Hey dolls, welcome back. Today's tutorial is gonna be a glittery eye with a glossy lip. We're gonna first start off with our eyebrows. We're just gonna comb them through with a clean spoolie. We're gonna go in with our MAC spiked eyebrow pencil and we're just gonna carve out those eyebrows. Doesn't have to be perfect. Then we're gonna go in and fill in our eyebrows with our MAC Espresso eyeshadow. We're just gonna go in and fill in those empty areas where our eyebrows are kind of thin. Just fill them into your liking. Then we're gonna go in with our MAC concealer in the color NW30 Studio Finish Concealer. And we're just gonna carve them out. We're gonna also prime our eyes with this. So you can just go ahead and prime your eyes with this. And we're just gonna clean it up by taking a clean brush and carefully wiping away some of that concealer. We're just gonna carve out the top of our eyebrows. This is optional. You can also use your foundation to carve out the top of your eyebrows, but I like that extra highlight, so I do the top as well. Then we're gonna go in and with our eyes. We're gonna go in with the Saddle by MAC and we're just gonna put this in our crease area and just blend this back and forth using the windshield wiper motions. Apply a generous amount. You kind of want this to be a little bit dark. Then we're gonna go in with our espresso just to darken that crease up a little bit more. Kind of focus on the outer corner V and apply that espresso color and bring it in just towards the center of your eyeliner. Next, we're gonna go in with our NYX Love and Rio um, Tri Palette in the, it's like LIR 14. I will have all the descriptions linked below. Then we're gonna go in with our glitter. We're gonna use the Revlon Photo Ready Eye Art and just use the glittery part. We're gonna use this as a base to apply our um, loose glitter. So just apply a little bit at a time because it will dry. I got this glitter from Hobby Lobby. It's just in the art section. It's just regular um, glitter, it's nothing fancy. And you're just gonna apply that right on top of where you um, put that Revlon Photo Ready Eye Art. And take your time with this because you don't want glitter everywhere and you definitely don't want to apply that glitter too high in your crease area. So just make sure it's symmetrical. And here's the finished eye. Then we're gonna go back in with our um, MAC Espresso eyeshadow and just make our crease a little bit darker. I'm taking a spoolie and just cleaning away some of that glitter. Please be generous with this because it will scratch your face. Um, I feel like it picks up the glitter well, but you can also use a towelette. Now I'm gonna go in with our ColourPop eyeliner in the color Swerved um, and applying my eyeliner on here. People have been asking me, how do you do your eyeliner? So I just take it and I drag it just a little bit. I don't do all one motion but I just apply a little bit on top of the lid close to my eyelashes go all the way on the inside and then once I get towards where I'm gonna do my wing I start from where my bottom is and I drag it up and then midway through I drag it back down and then I just fill that part in and that's how I create my wing eyeliner Now that our face is clean, we're gonna go in with our Milani Conceal in Perfect in the color Chestnut. Um, it's number 14, and I'm just gonna apply this how I usually apply my foundation, just all over. I love, love, love this foundation. It's just perfect. <laughs> then I'm gonna go in with the NYX um, Gotcha Concealer in the color Golden, and I'm gonna apply just a couple dots because if you, um, can see this is like a really intense HD um, concealer it's not showing up um, that well on the camera but it is so bright like it just illuminates your face then I'm gonna go in and set that um, concealer with my Ben Nye banana powder I'm not baking I'm just gonna go ahead and sweep this as soon as I put it off I feel like when we bake it's just way too powdery so I'm just cleaning this off with a precise brush and then I'm going in with a bigger brush and just sweeping um, that powder away. Next we're going to contour with a new um, powder. It's going to be the Ruby Kisses Mineral Powder in the color Cognac 
and we're just gonna do our normal contour contour our nose our cheeks fix my nose ring <laughs> Then I'm going to go in with my MAC um, Swiss Chocolate and just to darken up that contour because that Ruby Kisses was a new product that I was trying and I felt like it wasn't as dark. Then we're going to go in with our Professional 10 Color Blush Palette by BH Cosmetics and then we're going to use um, that shade right there at the bottom and just apply that on our apples of our cheeks. Blush it up, honey. Then we're gonna go in for our highlight slash bronzer with our MAC Gold Deposit and apply this all over our face. And now I'm gonna go in with, with the color Saddle and apply this all in my waterline of my eye. So I'm gonna do a very light mascara, so I just kinda wanna darken this up a little bit. Then we're gonna go in with the Espresso and focus on the outer corner of our waterline and just drag it all the way kinda to the center. This will give that smoky effect. Now we're gonna go in with our Nika K um, Cosmetics Mascara and just apply however you wanna do your bottom mascara. I do mine this way because my lashes aren't that long, so. Just apply that all over. Then I'm taking just a clean spoolie. I do have individual lashes on, so I'm just cleaning those. And this is my finished look without my lip gloss. I'm gonna go in with my NYX Cosmetics um, Butter Gloss in the color Fortune Cookie and just apply this onto my lips. I felt like a nude lip would be perfect for this look. And here's the finished look. Thank you guys for coming back to my channel. If you guys are new, make sure you're subscribed, thumbs up this video, and um, yeah, see you in our next video. Thank you guys.